In this video, we're going to take a look at how to do some of the basic edits in GAM 350. The basic edits, move, copy, delete, rotate, mirror, all pretty much work the same way in GAM 350. There's filtering that you can use to select the proper items. Uh, you select the item that you want to do this to, and usually if you're selecting multiple items, you select a source point and a destination point. So let's take a look at move, first of all here. I can simply pick up an item and move it. I can also use the move command to grab multiple items just by using the control select and selecting multiple items. Once I've selected all the items that I want, I select a source point and a destination point. I can use window mode for selection and everything that's entirely within the window is selected. Then again I select a source point and a destination point. I can use other filtering. Um, this is in the move copy any command basically. I have a filter option here where I can select items by decodes. Uh, I can even go into the decode filter selection box here, unselect all, pick a couple of items, say OK and OK and then when I window or do a select all on this layer it's only going to select those particular items. In this case it was these traces here. So if I wanted to copy those off to somewhere, I would select a source point and a destination point, and it would copy those traces for me. Other filtering available to you, draws, flashes, drills, mills. Um, in the copy command, we have the option to copy to multiple layers at one time. So this is useful when copying text from one layer to multiple layers. And we can do an offset as well. So if I wanted to, say, select everything on this layer or even let's just take those two traces there and uh, my source point is here and I want three copies of them and my destination is here you can see that it's copied them as a group so I can kinda of do a step uh, if you will a copy step and repeat uh, inside of the cam editor here in cam 350 so once again, all those items basically work the same way. Uh, if I want to delete, I can use the window command, select the items I want to delete. It'll give me an idea of how many items I have selected, say OK, and delete those items. Some other edit commands that you may use, there's a delete segment option, where I just delete a segment of a trace instead of an entire trace. There is a chamfer option where I can actually add a chamfer to a, to a line. There is a move vertex or segment option where I can actually move a vertex. I can even add a vertex. And of course I can delete a vertex. So these are some of the other edits that you may be interested in in CAM 350.